Hello, I'm Sabina Pan, a CPA financial planner. I advocate for you to pay less taxes legally, legitimately, and ethically. Our practice focuses on tax smart investing and wealth building. Today, I like to make sure you are protecting your gain by placing or maintaining self stock orders on your stock or ETF holdings. I often advise you to have a self stock orders in place in order to ensure you lock in profits on positions that have gone up. I want to make sure you protect your gains in case the market declines sharply. This is always a part of investing strategy, but it's even more important now. A sell sell order is an order you can place with your broker to automatically sell holding if it falls to a price you specified. For example, let's assume you bought the Vanguard small cap growth ETF BBK at $164.65 and you place a sell stop order on this ETF at $255. BBK is above $255 now, but if you were to fall to $255, your sell stop order would trigger your broker to automatically sell it. You would get a 55% profit, which is sale price of $255 plus $0.93 cents of dividend divided by your $164 purchase price. So you are locking in a nice gain and protecting yourself against future losses. Why I recommend using sell stock order on positions that have appreciated considerably so you can lock in gains, you can also use them to limit losses. For example, we have a sell stock of 1175 on a new S&P 500 by right income fund, BXMX. We bought BXMX at $13.51 and if the stock order gets executed, we will lose money. But our losses will be minimal. In this case, we're using a sell stock to protect us from a sharp decline. If you find this video useful, please click on like, subscribe, and forward to those who may also benefit from this tutorial. Please also head to basecpaplus.com to sign up for our email newsletter for the tips for less taxes and more investment returns. Until next time, God bless.